Hey guys, welcome back. So this is actually the second time I've shot this. Um, it is hotter than the sun, not quite, but close, in this room today. And I feel like I just basically melted and was a sweaty mess in the first one. Um, and I was warbling a lot. I've tried to calm myself. I've been downstairs and cooled down a little bit, come back up here. And hopefully I won't be waffling as much in the second version because it was, it was really waffly. But it was my birthday earlier this week. Hooray, I turned 33. Um, wow, I have been doing these videos for, I think about 12 years now. I still really love watching these kind of videos and I know a lot of you love watching them too because I get asked to do them every year. So here we are again, what I got for my birthday. I had the most wonderful birthday. I was actually really, really lucky. Um, my birthday is the 19th of July, which if you're in the UK, you will know that date a, a lot because it's been in the press a lot is the day that the restrictions lifted. Not that it made too much of a difference to what we did for my birthday because um, we actually had, the weekend we actually had a few people over in the garden for a little like dinner party barbecue. Um, and then Mike, me and River went to London for two nights. One night we stayed in the flat and we just kind of saw a friend for dinner and kind of just mooched about in London. And then on my birthday we went for lunch with another couple of friends and then we checked into a lovely hotel and just had a little like staycation. The whole thing was amazing, but I don't think it was like massively affected by the fact that um, it was like the day the restrictions lifted because we didn't like we weren't like doing anything in a big crowd but um, it was definitely like a kind of positive feeling to the whole time which was re actually really really nice and obviously the weather has been insanely good as well so a little bit too warm maybe but I'm trying not to be British and complaining about when it's miserable and then complaining when it's hot as well it's been amazing it's super sunny um, so anyway I thought I would share with you all a few of the lovely gifts that I got for my birthday in no particular order because it's just too hot for being organized. My brain cannot function properly right now. First of all, this little beach bag, this might look familiar because it's actually from the same brand as the bag that Mike got me for my last birthday, which is the Jacksons. And they make these like hand woven kind of tote reusable bags. You can use them as a handbag. You can use them as a baby bag. You can use them for groceries, whatever you want, a beach bag. Um, I had a really cute one last year, obviously still have it, but um, I used it basically daily for most of last summer. And I actually haven't dug it out yet this year, but I'm going to. It's like a beigey one that says weekend with a big pink heart on it. This was from my friend Libby. It says Sunday and I love the color. The thing I love about these is that it expand massively so you can fit barely anything in them and they don't look too big but then equally you can fit loads of stuff in them and they expand and just don't they're like really really strong as well so they'll hold quite a lot of weight love that such a nice generous gift from my friend Libby and it was clearly the year of the beach bag because my best friend Lissy I feel like the names are similar, sorry guys. Um, got me this beach bag, which is super cute. This is more of like a giant beach bag. You feel like a beach towel, etc. cetera. And, um, really sweet and super colorful and just happy. It looks like a happy bag to me. It's from a brand called America and Beyond. I've never heard of it before, but I like it a lot. Um, that is all I know about it. It's got lots of detail on the front. Very happy, very summery. It would look cute with like just a plain white beach dress, I think. I'm gonna put that behind me. Another thing I got from my friend Rima was this, which is the cutest little package. You guys might know if you've been following me on Instagram um, and if you know me in real life like she does, we've recently been redoing our kind of home cinema room um, and it's almost finished and she got me like a little cinema kit. So it's basically like this really cute basket, a cozy blanket, lots of popcorn, Riv's already tucked into one of them, popcorn little, um, boxes she also got me a bottle of whispering angel rosé which is my fave but that's in the fridge already how cute is that i loved that i thought it was so sweet and then my other friend kelly also got me this cushion i'm not sure where this is going to live yet but it's super cute kind of like tassely cushion i got that from my friend as well and then what to show you next mike's sisters got me some lovely presents this year as every year i feel like they always nail presents um one of them was the was this little bowl which i feel like it's probably meant to be like a nut bowl or something you know what i mean like little snacks maybe some crisps i feel like it's too pretty for food like look at it it's actually quite mesmerizing to look at it's from a brand called dinosaur designs i hadn't heard of them before it's kind of a resin material really really nice and then 
actually I'm not, I'm gonna deviate. I also got a set of bowls like this. There's actually a few of them, but they're super heavy, so I don't wanna pick them all up, from the girls that I work with. This is a brand called Hot Pottery. Again, I had never heard of this, but I absolutely love the style of this. It's like kind of splattered color on the glaze. I feel like it's really nice as well to have a whole set of serving dishes the same. Something, maybe you guys do have it, but we don't. We don't have a set of serving dishes that kind of all match, and I feel like it's really nice because they're all different shapes and sizes, so you can fit all different kinds of food in, but they all match, which is super nice. So I love that. I'll put that down over here because they're very breakable. And then from Mike's other sister, she got me a framed picture of me and Riv, which is super cute. It's actually up on the mantle over there, which I'm not gonna show you, but she also got me this little t-shirt which says La Riviera, um, just like Riv, and um, it's got a lemon, super cute little map of the south of France, really nice. It's actually from J. Crew. I haven't shopped in J. Crew in forever, um, super cute, and she got me a few of these candles as well, which are like double coloured neon dipped um, candlestick, candlesticks? No, candle, what, what even type of, pillar candles? No, they're not pillar candles. Am I being really dummy, stick candles? The ones that you put in little candlesticks anyway I'm just gonna stop talking about that now they're really cute and then what else did I get oh I got some giant marshmallows from my sister along with if I can reach them dun, da, 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 some pokery prong telescopic extending marshmallow toasters because they have these and last time my sister came over to our house, we were trying to toast marshmallows in the pizza oven, but obviously you can't get your hand in because it's really, really hot. So she was like, you need some of these extendable prongs. So we're gonna have to exercise some extreme caution with River around because I can feel like, I can see that being, ending in disaster. Um, Riv's already tucked into the giant marshmallows, but that was a cute little present. And then she also got me a dress. I nearly fell off the chair then, and I put my light on because something weird is going on with the lighting outside. I think it's just got a bit cloudy all of a sudden. But she also got me this little dress, which is from Claudie Piello. Super cute little silk dress. And really, like, not a colour or a pattern I would have picked because I never, I don't often go for, like, blue or red, actually. But I really like this, I think it's really pretty. It's a really kind of like floaty, pretty dress. I'm probably gonna belt it. Um, so that was from my sister and her family. And then I also got from, where am I gonna go next? Mike's parents got me the nicest gift. So I follow a brand called Birdie Fortescue on Instagram. It's like an interiors kind of um, kitchen wares brand. And Mike's parents got me a full set from this brand so they got me four of these plates which are the white cabbage plates which are super pretty they got me four linen napkins in this print which again i love it kind of reminds me a little bit of that dress as well actually with the blue and the red flowers so cute and then lastly this is my absolute favorite actually it's not lastly because they got me some tea lights as well but these um placemats had a complete brain fart there scalloped placemats i think they're absolutely gorgeous i love them so they got me a set of four of those so next time we have four people for dinner i'm going to use all of these and lay them out beautiful tablescape um they also got me these little um tea light holders which are lovely blown glass in like a nice baby pink pattern super cute that was from mike's parents i was gonna say family but parents and then my parents gave me this ring that i'm wearing i don't know if you guys noticed it as i've been talking but it's basically the center stone is peridot or peridot i think it's actually peridot but i always say peridot because it sounds nicer um and it has like a halo of stones around it really really pretty i get a lot of questions about my aqua colored square cut ring that i've been wearing a lot recently i actually got that one for christmas from my mum. um if you don't know my mum like buys and sells and deals in antique and vintage jewelry on instagram so i feel like she always buys me and always has bought me kind of vintage um and antique jewelry so it's kind of like a bit of a tradition for mum. like she's that's just what she's into so i love this i think it's so pretty i absolutely love the color i love peridot it's so nice um and then what else did i get oh before i show you what mike and river got me a couple of presents from friends that are probably the coolest things ever so one of my friends got me a lemon tree this year which I think it's like the coolest present ever. It's from my friend Bales and her husband Tom. And I just absolutely love it. I've always wanted a lemon tree. I don't even know why, but I am very, very excited about the prospect of potentially growing my own lemons. I think it's gonna live inside because I think if you can have lemon trees outside in the UK, but I think you have to almost like wrap them up in like a 
sleeping bag over the winter but I think it's gonna live inside I need to do a bit of research to see where it would be happiest but I got a lemon tree from them and then I also got a um, a vine so like a, a grape plant grape vine from my other friend Sam and Lauren which is such a nice present and they also made me a candle we have a little bit of a tradition um, between I guess it's mostly between me and Lauren rather than Sam um, but we basically always give each other candles and this time they made me a candle which is super cool and really special and actually smells amazing they did a really really good job I couldn't tell you the notes it did say on the label like on the outer packaging label but I threw it away I thought it was actually stuck on the pot and it's not so um, it's a mystery scent but it smells really good and they made it especially for me which is super nice of them um, and then moving on to what River got me so obviously River conspired with Mike just a little bit she's only three and a half um but she bought me matching pjs to her pjs I got these pajamas for her from the white company about a month ago um and they have the matching adult ones and she bought them for me super cute cotton gingham pink pajamas and they've got little hearts I love matching with Riff but sometimes matching clothes can be a little cheesy even though I still like doing it um matching pjs I feel like you can do as much as you want and no one's gonna judge you because you're in bed um so yeah love those and then she also got me these trainers which are from New Balance I've been trying to get these for absolutely ages, but they've been sold out everywhere. I managed to get hold of them a few months ago in my size, but it turns out they run really small. So I've actually sized up an entire size um, in these. Mike managed to find them in a size six, and they fit, which is kind of crazy. But yeah, if you are looking for like the classic New Balance, I think these are the five four five two, maybe. I think they're the four five two style. Does it say anywhere on them? Yeah, four five two says on the back there um but yeah really really like those and they're super super comfy as well so finally managed to get those in my size and then last but not least Mike actually bought me a necklace this year and I have to say I think I'm gonna exchange it not because I don't like it because I actually like I've wanted this necklace for ages and Mike knew about it and bought it because I basically told him that I really loved it um it is this necklace from Alighieri which is called the Laura like as in Laura um pendant choker pendant something like that um i had my eye on this for months i have the earrings the matching earrings which i absolutely adore and i love this i love the way it looks i think it's so unusual with the mixed metals but it is so heavy i put it on and i was like i actually don't think i can wear this it's that heavy and kind of uncomfortable to wear and i think it will limit the amount that i wear it it's from Alighieri. Um, did I say that already? It's getting my, honestly, this heat is starting to fry my brain again. Um, but it's from a brand called Alighieri, which I absolutely love. Um, so I might exchange it for something more lightweight from them because it really is just super heavy. I'll try it on for you guys and show you. Um, but I was really gutted because I love, like I said, I love the way it looks, but I just think I won't wear it a lot because it is, it's like wearing, it's literally a ball and chain around your neck like you are weighed down but yeah very very pretty design absolutely love that and he's so cute that he actually went and got it for me he's so kind um we just had the best time i had the best day um and we had such a nice time being able to celebrate with a few of our friends as well we actually managed to get all of our like we have a group of five girlfriends from school and we managed to all get back together again for the first time in ages um and it was just amazing so i think that is all my presents i have to show you i think that is it i'm just checking around my feet just in case but i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you have any requests for new or different videos over the next few weeks because i'm going to be doing my kind of content schedule coming up next week so let me know if you have any suggestions or requests hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you soon bye guys